uh, weirdly appropriate <laughs> rock music for for swinging around space here. Okay, trade and give me a thousand plastics, please. All right, we have one, we have but one destination. Also, what else do I have on here? Iron oxide. Oh, right. Um, Blue shores go there real fast. Three days tra travel. Make a little more progress along this uh, path of this one. Give us some money. We need it. Okay, read and give you this. All right, we're almost, uh, yeah, we're just about halfway. <laughs> we're a little, a little bit before halfway there. So. All right, and now we head to Serenity. 11 days travel. Okay. Go duck here. Cause we're gonna have a bunch of upgrades to do, I think. Um see what I can Muster here with us. If we want to get the tools production up, I, I I wonder if I should just get that, just focus on that and getting that to. Well, I need to upgrade the other things too because it relies on the other stuff, right? Like it relies on steel and the plastics. Um, so, 
feel like, so what are we at now? Plastics, refinery, and steelworks. We're at... Our plastic production plant is, is only level one. What does he do at level one? Wait, who's at level one? Um, plastics. Eight. Eight plastics in one day. So, and how many does it take for the tools? Two. So I could, I could upgrade my tool factory. So how many steel do we do? We're doing 12 steel in one day and eight plastics. I could get my tool factory up to, let's see. Um, what are we at now? We're at level three foundry? No, tool factory. Level two. So, and what's our foundry take? None of that, it just does its own thing. And the electrolyzes would be the big ticket item level three um what does he take yeah maybe i'll just focus on the electronics lab let's get the electronics up to level 10 screw it let's do it let's do it Get the foundry up to level 10. Boom. And... Okay. Um... I am docked with them, right? Let's trade. Oh, it's going to use the stuff in here first. That's fine. We'll, we'll use the stuff that's in there first. Um, all right. Normal map. Give a day. Station builds. And details. Five. Okay, so it needs a little bit of plastics. Braid. Uh, we'll do that. 11. Boom. So then... Info, orbital map. Uh, sector info. No, orbital map. Uh, skip a day. Bam. And then... From here... Uh, let's, before I do this, let's trade all my stuff over so we can just keep doing this. Um, transfer all this stuff over here. Transfer, transfer, there we go. And then let me undock because it sounds like I'm constantly hitting thing here, which is not ideal. Let's back up just a bit. There we go. Yeah, actually, we have taken we have taken damage. Look at that cooling engines RG, RCS. Yeah, we took damage, which is not cool. Um, but I do have a repair dock here. So actually, we could go dock with my repair outpost, couldn't I? Could do that. <laughs> we'll repair over there. And then while we're doing that, we'll get uh, this other guy squared away here. Okay, upgrade to level six. And don't trade anything. 
Right, and then once we once we dock, I'll skip a day. Well, actually, I'll I'll have my guy get repaired here. But we're doing we're killing two birds with one stone because yeah, he's suddenly taking damage from just being docked there, which was not not ideal. Actually, I should have did this first, just like transfer everything over first and then and then start doing the upgrade. I just didn't, I forgot that it won't let me trade things over once you've started an upgrade and it's already got the parts. Alright, very nice. Let's go sector info. Uh repair all fleets. Forty days. Really? Forty days to repair? Wow. Why would that cost so much? There are multiple things that need to be repaired here. That's crazy. Maybe some of these stations got damaged too. I don't know. I don't know why it would take 40 days, but there you go. We're stuck there for 40 days, it looks like. Uh, okay. Info. And we took a ton of damage, apparently. Jeez Louise. Oh yeah, our RCS was down to 33%. I guess that's... Wow. Um, Alright. So, details here. Upgrade to level 7. Don't trade, even though I know it doesn't matter. It's just going to skip a day anyway. And do it again. Yeah, we'll just let that go there. Okay. Uh, and level nine foundry. Your right group has entered Boneyard. Seven meteorites threatening Boneyard now. I want to bet all seven hit me. Because <laughs> Lord knows I can't catch a break with any of that stuff. Uh, and more details here. Level 10 foundry. Yep, Mirai crashed. On our complex. Of course it did. Of course it did. How much damage did it do? 75%. Uh, it did 25% damage. But at least it didn't hit the mines anyway. So they're still producing. So at least we got away somewhat unscathed there. Uh, okay, so. Foundries at... Level 10. Uh, let's get our plastic productions up and yeah. How much more do we have here? Quite a bit actually. Right, let's get our plastic production up.
and get another level on it. We'll get another level on our steelworks. Try to do these maybe in lockstep. Okay, and still have a little bit more. We're, plastics are going to be the limiting factor right now. That's fine. Details, so get a level three tool factory. There we go. All right, we don't have enough plastics to do anymore. Well, we can do, let's upgrade our research. We have enough for that. Because why not? We're stuck here for a couple more days. So, actually a bunch more days. Um, yeah. Re the Oh, we're down to... Oh, I don't have 40,000 credits. Wow, I've gone through lots and lots of credits there. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> I'm like, why is that not working? Oh, I've gone through a whole bunch of credits. That's why it's not working. All right. Let's uh, kill a few days, I guess. There we go. There's 48, 49... Uh, sector info, bam, and details. Uh, actually, I probably have a hundred in there now. Yeah, so let's do, uh, let's get a level two ice mine going because I think we're going to need it. Um, I think. There we go. And you're going to have to wait another day, I think. Uh, 25 days left on the repairs. All right. That's a pretty significant amount of time for repairs. Uh, actually, I probably should just tell this thing to start repairing, right? Oh, well, it's under construction, right? Um, so, I don't know how that works. It's under construction and it was damaged. Well, it's not entirely under construction. Yeah, so I guess that's fine. It'll take 40 days to repair. Yeah, that's, let's get that started. It takes me down to 50 credits, which is not good. I just realized that. Um, great, great news there. All right, luckily we've got some things going. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to fast forward. Build up some credits here. Look at that. Look at that. Credits going up and down. There we go. One fleet repair is finished. Um, awesome. How many days we have left on this one? Uh, 15 days. I wonder if that, it looks like it actually stopped doing it. But let's repair that. Kind of looked like it had stopped, but 15 days is, is fine there on that. Um... Speaking of, get the current sector we're in. Wow, look at that. Look at all of that. Uh, fuel, tools, plastic steel. We've almost got a thousand electronics. Um, so we're producing electronics like a mofo, which is fantastic. 
Then go sell those off and make a boatload of money. Um, how many? Well, this other thing's under. Other things being repaired though. But how many electronics does this need? Yeah, I'm not necessarily in a rush to do this. Let's let's build up our credits again. Let's go see who wants electronics and we'll give them all the electronics they could ever want. Who's paying top dollar for it? Winter Junction it needs 200 though. Miner's Home. Miner's Home needs 6,000. Which will be good because I can just go to one place and just sell it. Rather than having to go to all these different places. Let's go right here and sell it. I imagine that's a storage hub too, probably, right? Let's see if there's a storage hub there. Uh, oh, wait. Miner's Home. Where's that? There's storage hub here. Cool. I can just dump it all into the storage hub and let them deal with it and still get paid. Uh, cool. So let's come on over here and dock. Just turn a profit on that because that'll be what 700 at 50 each, 58 each. That'll, that'll be a different, a decent, a decent number. I'm not going to even try the math in my head. <laughs> just gonna, just gonna roll with it. Uh, because it'd be like what 5,800 times seven pretty much with a little extra on there so yeah a decent chunk of change and i know i want to keep it for my construction over there but uh, you know what screw it <laughs> Or I could put it in the, the pendulum thing, but I, I'm not in any rush to do that yet. I, I suspect that that will unlock the 10th artifact that I haven't found yet, but at the same time, I kind of want to, uh, I'm also afraid it'll like suddenly cause some sort of military strike or something and I have no military ships. To speak of. Okay. Trade. Let's take all of this. Uh, all of these electronics. I will take those and I mean, how many plastics do I need? Because I could fulfill some of this while we're here. It would be faster. I need what? 200 plastics? 200 plastics, 500 tools. And three hundred and three hundred and ninety-three steel. Basically four hundred steel, basically. Four hundred steel, five hundred tools, two hundred plastics. When we have that Uh, 
let's take uh, 200 plastics. Uh, 500 tools. And 393 uh, steel. All right, and I'll at least get those met, and then it will, we'll have to work. We'll have to wait on the electronics. Uh, complex. Dock with it. I think my next thing now is to just the uh, the big three resources um, use those upgrade the mines here um, in this in this sector. I think I'll um, I'll get those mines into this complex. The problem is. Complex is still under construction. If I put the mines in here, well, I'll build the mines here. And I'll leave the other mines where they're at so that they're still producing stuff. Because I, this won't produce anything until all the construction is complete. So, and I'll just be waiting on the electronics, which it won't be a, a long wait, right? Because we'll be doing 100 electronics every five days, right? Is that... I think that's what it is. Yeah, 100 electronics every five days. And we need, um, how much do we need? So we need 900 roughly, we'll say really 800, 810. So eight times five is 40. So 40 days and we'll have enough. All right. That's well into the next year. Uh, so now we're docked. Let's go give it all of this that it needs. There you go. Okay, only thing left is the electronics. Um, yeah, but I want to go make some money first before we do that. So, uh, who was it that had the electronics? Myers Home. The 8.96. All right. Let's go do it. Go do it, do it. Storage hub. Dock. We'll sell off our electronics here.
Do a little spin and burn. Very nice. It's 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 cool to just watch the <laughs> watch the AI and it do its do its thing here and just kind of glide you right on in. Although it's a little bit uh, a little bit unsure of itself lately for some reason. There we go. A little overcompensation going on. All right, take these electronics. 43,000 credits. I am back up over 100,000. And over here, we're right up to 200 electronics. So, yeah, we'll, we'll bounce back from that pretty quickly. Um, those are. You know, three and stuff down here. This is probably all, yeah, this is all out of space, right? Again. Yeah. Well, uh, you know what? I'm just going to take these to my uh, other place here. Let's go travel. Bam. There we go. And I'm going to put these into, the, I'm going to deliver these, hand deliver these to the, uh, to our complex. So everything keeps moving smoothly. And I think the other thing is I wanted to grab... Did I refuel these things in Boneyard? I don't think I did. Uh, yeah, I mean, they're not terrible. A lot of silica building up, though. If he's not trading, you're not picking up the silica. He's just picking up the iron. What's going on there. What is going on there? I ask. Green Fleet Five will arrive in seven days. Um, what do you have on you. Right. Where's the um. My silica and iron to Serenity. You're traveling to Boneyard. Two days left. Hmm. Hmm. That's weird. my pill fleet capacity is a hundred hmm uh, let's limit the inventory To 50. Yeah, I think that's what we need here done. And then, because I think he's just taking the iron oxide, he's not taking the other stuff. I think that's what's happening here. Alright, so we'll limit the inventory and, and the wait time. Alright, that should, that should be better uh, and then I should look at my my other trade fleet uh, gas from Spire because I think this is suffering from the same problem here 
Raid route. Yeah, I think it's only he's loading up entirely on H2 and not any of the other things. So what do you have? You have 400. So that's why these guys keep filling up. I think. Um, let's edit that. Let's limit your inventory to. Um, a hundred, maybe. Yeah, limit to a hundred. And then we'll limit you to a hundred. And then we'll limit you to uh actually the methane should be methane should be two hundred. Yeah. We we're producing that faster than everything else. And then the helium three limit you to a hundred right then that should be the 400 then right 200 300 400 all right that's i think that's what's happening it's not he's not taking from all three he's just grabbing the first one and, and just jetting out um all right that's that's fine that is fine okay Good to know. I, I guess I should have figured that out at, at the beginning, but I, you know, I thought maybe the game was had an algorithm that was balancing it out, you know. But yeah, whatever. It doesn't matter. It makes sense that you would have to put that in yourself. Uh, so we're in the spire. Did I? I just docked right. Let's grab all that. And hydrogen pump is okay. Yeah, see, because the hydrogen pump is always like very low, so I'm like, must be taking everything just from there and nothing from any anywhere else, because these are filling up. So, that's probably why our efficiency is not so great. Maybe. I don't know. Another station under construction here? Who is constructing a station? Uh, and what is that station? Hmm. That's a good question. Storage hub. Uh, huh. I don't know what station's under construction. It's not telling me. Oh, the shipyard's under construction. Huh. Ah, I see. I see. They're trying to upgrade their they're trying to upgrade their shipyard to level two. Which looks like costs quite a bit. Uh, make a mental note of that. Twelve hundred, twelve hundred, twelve hundred, and then hundred and twelve hundred to uh, electronics too. Which is like the thousand, thousand, thousand for the other thing, so I guess that makes sense. Um Speaking of, 12, 21 research. Still not quite there. We want to grab that. I definitely, I definitely want to grab um, Shipyard next. Weird to see some colors here again. <laughs> it's like, oh, I can actually afford stuff on the screen. I, I, I'm not entirely on board with the, every time you research something the next thing costs 
that much more. Um, it's unfortunate they went that route. Like everything should have just had a fixed price and then you could get through this, but whatever. Whatever. Uh, yep, grab all of that. All right, we're going to pop on over to Serenity. And drop all this stuff off. This, uh, finish repair? Yeah, okay. Cool. Um, info. Go here and dock. This is the thing with this game. I was like, oh, I'm going to have like a slightly shorter stream. Maybe only two hours. And now I'm like, oh, wow. I'm approaching hour three. <laughs> I definitely want to have a, a cutoff at least slightly early. Because um, I want to, I need to get some things edited. If I can wrap my brain around it tonight to get some editing done that'd be fantabulous and it's coming up on midnight so i don't have a whole lot of time to edit but if i can get just a few things going we'll be we'll be good for the week all right trade give you all of that and give you all of that not to worry about it I'm curious over here though, how, how are we doing with, yeah, we got a lot of stuff there and this is, I've got trade turned on and this is out of space, the silicon mine, <laughs> it's only a level one, um, so no one's really trading the silica over there, luckily this guy has got some space, but still, um, Want to dump? No, I don't want to dump it. Um, but he has almost no fuel left. Great. In fact, he is waiting for resources. He's waiting for more fuel. <laughs> oh, fun stuff. Fun stuff indeed. I mean, I got fuel here, right? We're docked at our main fuel source at the moment. Uh... Read what we got here. 400 electrons. I guess I might as well grab that while we're here. And I'll grab, uh, I guess, 400 fuel. Firm. All right, real fast. We're going to do this, and this is going to be the stopping point. Let's go to Boneyard here and drop off this stuff. There we go, at our station complex. So we're a little further along. Okay, Put these electronics in there. 
So we're more than halfway done with the electronics. Got a little ways to go with that. And now we'll pop on over to the dig. Six days travel. There we go. To our iron mine. Uh, we'll go to our logo mine first, I guess. This is closer. And pop over to the iron mine. And then, uh, yeah, I'll just grab all the silica off of here. Why not? Feeling good here though, because we're really, everything's starting to come together. Like, um, I mean, it's spent ton of money on upgrades but now the upgrades are far enough along that we're just producing goods at a nice clip it's just now we gotta start selling stuff selling lots and lots of stuff sell 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 which won't be too bad because I can just you know selling electronics is Giving us a, a bunch of money. I mean, the amount of electronics we're making, I can sell those and ha and get an upgrade out of it. You know, 40, 40 grand at least. So, that's always good news. And we still have a bunch of contracts too. Uh, Right, and you've got almost all the fuel you need, so I'm not going to give you any fuel. You, however, need the fuel. You're a level 9. I guess I could set this guy to trade his iron iron oxide. Well, you know what? He's got enough here that I might be able to finish. No, I can't finish that contract. I think once I finish his iron oxide contract, I think I'll tell him to just um to just, I'll just set tr trade on that. Yeah. Then I get this money and then, and then I don't have to deal with it. Although I set trade on the other one here and it doesn't seem to have, no one seems to be trading with me. <laughs> you know what I mean? The output on that. But I guess maybe that only works intra sector, maybe. Uh, we think it, the AI would be seeing that there's trade here and be like, "All right, let's go, let's go do that." But whatever. Do 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 do. All right, excellent. Trade. Uh, I will grab all of that, and I will give you all of this in return. Um, where are we going to go with this? Blue Shores. Pop on over there. A lickety split. Lickety split, I say. Dock with them. How are we doing otherwise here? Like every time a couple days pass, I'm like, how much more is left on here? <laughs> 300 electronics we have. Uh, we needed like 500, right? For this. Or 400 and change. 
you know, we need 410. It's every five days on that one. What, what, uh, where's the cycle at right now? We're part way through. Like probably two days into it. So, yeah, we could wait for that amount of time and then just pull that over and just get that, just get that, uh, get that done. Why not? In just a few short minutes. Because we just, according to the, the live stream, we've just crossed the three hour mark. I know for the recorded footage, it'll be a few minutes less, so I can go a little bit over that and then maybe we'll get like three even Steven, <laughs> relatively even Steven uh, uh, episodes there. Alright, and confirm. Bam, alright, we're at 1836 now. Out of 2478. So we still got a ways to go on that. And then um I'll just drop the silicon dioxide off of my with its serenity here. Um uh, anything else we need it? I think we're good. Yeah, let's head here. 11 days. Up to 171,000 credits. Fantastic. And all these Trade Fleet 2 is killing, killing it, man. Um, okay. One in here. And Doc, also, did my uh, efficiency for that other... Other routes go up. It's like 75% okay, it says there. And I guess 47% okay. Hmm. Alright. That's fine. Boom, 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 boom. I like it. I like it. Eight hundred tools. Plastics. We're at like 20k that we can store too. What is that? 2,000 fuel is being produced. Iron oxide, we're still we're on the low end, but it's you know we're still still coming in. Hmm. I don't have that much money to do a lot of stuff, but I could take, use 80,000, right? So if I take 200 of all those, which would get us the two mines. All right, let's do it. Since we're headed that way anyway, let me just drop this off. Uh, we'll take... Uh, I should probably take fuel as well. Uh, we'll take... Oh, I don't... I won't need fuel now. Um, I mean, I could probably use it for the other things, but I don't need it for this this one thing. Uh, I need electronics. I need... We have 500 exactly, so I need 400 and... 490, was it? Was that what I needed? Four hundred and ten, I mean. Yeah, I need four hundred and ten. Okay. Do that. So electronics. 
We'll take 410. Confirm. And then we'll take uh, 200 tools. 200 plastics. And 200 steel. Good. All right. Get over. Get over to the boneyard. This will be our last stop off tonight. And uh, go dock with the station complex. Good, good beat to. Outro the stream here. <laughs> the words are not quite coming. Uh, all right, here we go. Rolling along. be good because we can get the two mines set up and start them working uh the only thing we'll need to inject here is some helium three uh and some some water we get the whole complex going so i guess i probably should have taken the fuel with me eh, eh, whatever We can get that. We can do the haul that we need to do next time. To get this get this guy producing. But at least he'll be intact and ready to go. Okay, orbital map, give a day, bam, and now info, oh actually you know what, let's trade and throw all this over there, plastics, tools, uh, and then I'm going to have my guy head to uh the spire to get stuff here well that's going on uh yeah let's fast forward and do that there we go and now uh sector info uh let's go to the what do i need um do I need for this guy? Don't trade for anything, please. Um, game three and water, uh, which is. Helium three here. Wow, he's out of space again? Jeez Louise. You guy's really not picking things up here. Alright, well, um... Dark with the Helium-3 guy. While that's going on, Sector Info, or Orbital Map, I mean. Boneyard. 
from here, details, uh, central slot, let's add a, um, iron mine, confirm, uh, complex details, oh, I can only do, that's right, you can only do one at a time, all right. That's fine. And then uh, I'll grab some some water from my other mine because it's got a ton of it. Go to Shore of Ice. Swing by there. Grab it. Since there's a ton over there. And we'll get this guy at least start at production. I'll do. I, I said I was gonna leave that for next time, but let's just do it now because <laughs> I can't. I can't pull myself away as much as I want to. Um, game just gets its claws in you. Like every time I start the game, I'm like, hmm, what was I doing last time? What was I doing last week? And then, and then suddenly I'm like, bam! Every every neuron's firing, and it's just it's got this feedback loop that just pulls you in and just won't let you go uh, it's like i need sleep and it's like no you must you must stay and do more uh oh, i should look at my research too huh cool we're at 1405 research take that shipyard research bam there it is we can now build a shipyard and now yeah, everything like the quick repairs went up to 1174. Everything's 1174 on level three now. 1966 and 1957 for the higher ones. Then sectors do. Well, even more stations. Uh, negotiations. Yeah. Uh, probably go for. Um. Probably, well, quick repairs would be really nice, given how badly, I, how long it took to repair things. Um, 20 days instead of 4 days is great, but I think negotiations might be the next one that I want to do. Alright, let's just grab all this. He doesn't have a whole lot of fuel left either, so that's going to be, that's going to be an issue. going to be a bit of an issue. Um... Is this, can this sector, does this sector have light, has reduced light? Oh, it's dusty, so I can't do it. I would have to do the other thing to get fuel, which actually would work well here. That would work well here. The fusion thing, I just can't put it in a, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna put it in a, uh, um, Station complex because I have too many pumps, right? And I don't think these pumps will go on station complexes anyway. Um, or maybe they will. I don't know. Do these pumps go on station complexes? Let me see something here. Um, Oh, we're on the list. But maybe they do. And they don't have to, they don't need a central. Hmm. Mm, okay. Okay. We're cooking up another scheme here. <laughs> more, more fusion plants and central complexes and have the pump stations all around it. All getting fueled from it. That would actually save a hell of a lot. Um... Because then we know it's constantly being fueled, and actually, they were all that fuel would be. F it it wouldn't need any attention from me because the helium three being produced and stuff would go back to that. The only thing it would need is is water, which you can't do in this 
sector, right? Because it's just it doesn't ha it doesn't have ice. So yeah, you would still need to carry water to it, but that I mean not that terrible. Given my ice mines, given the ice mines just work without any input. Um. Okay. Cooking up more schemes, friends. Cooking up more schemes. Um. What was I even doing? Uh, I, I traded that guy. These guys are fine. Yeah, okay, yeah, and then I was going to go to... Door of Ice. Speaking of my ice mine. Grab some, some water from there. Because there's certainly some to spare. All right, and then the station. Yeah, that's right. The station was being built. Uh, where is it at? Over here. Um, don't trade for anything. Details. Okay, so that's the fusion power plant, the iron mine, and then I wanted a uh, silica mine. All right, confirm. And then that will... That's already ready to go. Cool. All right. Fast forward. Bam. And orbital map. Boneyard. How are you doing here? Don't trade for anything. Um, that's our outputs. Our inputs. And it just it just needs fuel now. Power itself. All it needs is some fuel. Fuel the fire. Then I can uh, I can tear down the other plants and use that use those parts to upgrade these. Might as well. Um, all right. Well, let's fast forward again. Here I group threatening boneyard in 15 days. Damn, again? Really? Really? Again? <laughs> Jesus Christ. I haven't had that many meteorites hit me that quickly in ever. Oh, we're in year six now. Day 28. Wow. Okay. Year five just blew right by, mostly because we were repairing. Uh, so, ice mine. Go duck. Go duck with my ice mine. Is there anyone else that has a contract for for water? The answer to that is no. I might even be able to do the thousand steel thing a lot sooner than I thought. 800 dihydrogen. I think we actually have a thousand steel right now, don't we? Damn near. Yeah, I could take care of that. I'm not taking care of that tonight, though. <laughs> Screw that. I need to. I need to have a stopping point. This will be my my stopping point. Is so I'll grab all of the water off this guy. That we can muster. Yeah, okay. Grab, grab all of the agua and uh, I know I have to refuel those other things, but I'm not going to do that right now. Grab all this. We'll head over, fuel up our one dude, um, scrap the other things, upgrade, use those parts from the scrapping to upgrade that station, to upgrade the mines there. Then I gotta fix the trade route, uh, which will be fine. Actually, I don't even need to fix the trade route, do I? Because it'll it'll just figure out that it's coming from a different place. Yeah. Uh, grab all of that. 
Or most of it. Sure. Um, there we go. Hit the bone yard. Four days travel. Wait, was it? Yeah, it was just water. Yeah, okay. Yep. There you go. All right, sector info. Go and dock here. We're hauling water. All in agua all around, friends. All in agua. Okay, I'm going to transfer all of the stuff over. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. And then we'll, because I need, yeah, transfer as much over as I can because I need some cargo room to do the scrapping for the other stuff. Yeah. Yeah, might as well. I think it's only going to let me do 4K, but that'll be fine. Even if it only lets me do 4K, I think. Because that's level 1 stuff, right? No, oh, actually, it's allowing 10K. All right, well then, everything goes over. All of it. Okay, there we go. Uh, so then, this should be able to... Start, maybe. Um, details. So, <clears throat> so what does the silicon mine need? Uh, Tenkrad's one fuel, one fuel. Uh, ten credits plus a hundred water. Plus one helium three is 200 fuel in five days. Oh, wow. This is really, I mean, it produces a lot of fuel, but it's, oh, it takes a lot. <laughs> it doesn't produce it, it produces it every five days. So that's just fun, fun times right there. Um, okay. So then with that said, with that said, I were to scrap these. Confirm. Confirm. All right, and then transfer all that over. Oh, it automatically, oh, cool. It, it did automatically transfer it into here. Sweet. That's exactly where I wanted to be. Okay. Um, cool. Let's go orbital map and we'll head down to the spire here. And while that's going on, let's go here and Let's not trade for those things. Thank you. Uh, let's go details. And plastic steel tools. Actually, we got a lot of plastic steel and tools back. That's interesting. Uh, let's. Oh, because these were multiple levels. That's what it was. Yeah, okay. Upgrade that. Um. Cool. Give a day. Back here. That. Details. 
uh, upgrade the iron mine. Here, skip a day. Info. I only have enough for one more upgrade, so let's make it count. Uh, wait, orbital map. Boneyard. And here, details. Let's upgrade the silica mine, I think. Maybe. Yeah. Upgrade that. All right, let's skip a day. Bam. All right, fast forward. Nice. Nice. Three days it's being threatened by a meteorite group, but that's fine. We'll just hope for the we'll hope for the best there. Uh, hopefully, uh, hopefully, Trade Fleet Four doesn't get <laughs> tied up in it. Um, yeah, is uh, Trade Fleet Four okay? I assume it's okay because it still has silica and iron, right, to trade. I mean, if it doesn't, even if it doesn't, I'll just wait three days and then move on to the next. So. We'll see uh, how that goes, but we'll see how that goes next time, friends. Uh, for those who will be watching the VOD, thanks so much for watching, and I will see you next time.